The Necrotize Intercolitis Society is a nonprofit organization that's dedicated to building a world without NEC. NEC or Necrotize Intercolitis, also known as NEC, is a devastating intestinal disease that affects babies in their first weeks and months of life. And the NEC Society works to advance NEC research, education, and advocacy by bringing together patient families who've been personally affected by the disease, as well as clinicians and researchers and other people who care. I created the Next Society because of my family's own devastation with this disease. We lost our son Micah to complications of necrotized enterocolitis, and I knew that my family's experience is not unique. I am an architect by profession, but in 2014, I lost my daughter Sarah to necrotizing enterocolitis. After Sarah died, I was shocked to learn about the lack of progress on this disease in the last 50 years. And so I just felt compelled to do whatever I possibly could to help other babies and families not to experience what we experienced. I was born in 1997 at 38 weeks and a few weeks after that I was diagnosed with neck and so I required a sigmoidectomy so basically part of my colon had to be surgically removed to save my life. Neck continues to affect my family today, even beyond the NICU. I think that a lot of us are very familiar with the idea of uh, the NICU journey being a very traumatic experience, but we don't often talk about the stress that comes with raising a medically fragile child. And I'm really apprehensive about my future. Uh, as I get older, I'm having more and more problems related to that disease that I had so long ago, and I'm struggling to find care for it. A lot of gastroenterologists refuse to help me because there's just not enough research that's been done. I've remained uh, deeply engaged with the Next Society's work uh, from its inception uh, because uh, I believe that neck is a vexing problem that has not been easily solved. And the activation energy that's happened with Next Society is unparalleled in our field of neonatology. The Next Society got involved and was funded through PCORI to look at research prioritization for NEC, which is a really important problem to solve because there's a lot of activity that goes around NEC and in order for us to really have shared vision and focus our resources on the most important problems, this is very pivotal for the stakeholders to do. Every individual researcher might have areas that they're focused on or interested in, but we don't really have this collective vision for what as a community, as a group, do we all have as shared priorities. That didn't exist before we took on this project. And, and what we really needed was a lot of diverse voices and perspectives to come together and say, together, this is what we think are the most important areas we should focus on. Many people outside of the NICU have never even heard of necrotized enterocolitis. I didn't hear of NEC until my baby was actually even being diagnosed. And so by raising awareness, we can bring in more people who care about this disease and really help us advance this work. What makes the NEC Society really unique is that we are led by patient families. We partner with clinicians and researchers and experts in science in everything we do, but we are truly led by people like me who have been impacted by this disease. And I think that that makes us unique and powerful. When I think about what my work at the Next Society means to me, there's, there's some poetry to it, really. I, I never really planned to do anything with medicine. I'm a very creative person. But when I think about it, I, I survived necrotizing endocolitis. And now I'm, I'm a part of the work to address the issues surrounding it. My work at the Next Society has brought me incredible peace. It has allowed me to keep Micah in my life and to share my story with other families and to find great meaning in my devastating loss. I'm compelled to do this work, not just because of Micah, but because I see how this disease continues to affect other families every day. And our vision is to create a world without neck and to help other families find peace and get involved and find meaning in their loss by helping other families. In the short run, I hope that the Next Society can help to inform and empower families so that when their baby's in the NICU, they can make the best choices for their baby's care and feel truly part of their baby's care team. I certainly hope that we can have an impact on reducing neck rates and improving outcomes for survivors. And in the long run, I hope that we can be part of ending this disease. The Next Society's work is important because they're saving lives through education, awareness, advocacy, and research. 
and they're addressing a disease that most people have never heard of. So if not the next society, then, then who? You can learn more, get involved, and make a donation to help us build a world without necrotizing colitis at nextsociety.org.